What's up, everybody? Y'all know who it is, Lost with Jerry. Man, y'all finally get a chance to ride along with Lost with Jerry here, man. I'm on my way out and about from the house, uh, getting tired of sitting up in the house all day, so I'm just going out cruising for a little bit. Probably make a stop at the store or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And uh, check out through my uh, buddies right quick, you know? <clears throat> but uh, this video is about a different video I want to talk to you guys about. It. Because y'all are my subscribers, and I'm gonna need y'all a little help with a little something, something, you know what I'm saying? So, I appreciate if y'all did help me out with this, you know what I'm saying? And uh, keep the crazy ones away with crazy answers. So, I need y'all to give me a good answer, which I think I should do, right? The question is, what should I do with my YouTube channel? What would y'all like to see more different from my YouTube channel? So, if anybody come out with a great ideal, I will take off with it. You know what I'm saying? And um, if it if it works out good, I put your name on every title with it. So that's how I want to do it. I want to put somebody else's name on my title when I do a video about what we're doing a video about. So I need you guys help with that. Uh, come out with your honest answer and just let me know what should I do with it. All right. So. Uh, Right now I'm in the car, so like I said, it's a little hot, so y'all might hear a little air conditioning thing going on in the car, but you know, I gotta have it, because otherwise the phone might cut off, so we just gotta make it easy and quick and better, you know, so right now I'm getting up on this 60 highway here, and the 60 is not no uh, 60 miles per hour out here, right now I'm rolling that 70, it says 65, but it's hard to do 65 out here when everybody else doing 75 or 80. So, that's what I'm trying to say. But, uh, man, it's back warm again. What they really said is really going to be hot between here and Vegas. Uh, it's going to be no more than like in the 120s, 30s, something like that for the rest of the couple of weeks. That's cool and all, you know. I ain't going to cry about it. You know, I just don't be out here all the time. All day long in the heat. Most time I'm in the house or I'm at work. So I did have to work on my days off. One of my days off, I had to go in and work. And I'm supposed to be off on Sunday, but um, they ended up calling me. No, that was Sunday. They was Saturday. They called me in. So Saturday called me in. I went in. Uh, Sunday was my day to go in. Anyway, I still went in. But I'm off today. And uh. Tuesday I go back in for a couple more days and I'm going to go for another couple more days again. So, I don't work at a big job out here, but it's, it pays okay, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, gets the bills paid for, you know. I still make my car note, I still make my insurance, I still pay for uh, gas, you know what I'm saying? So, it's still a job, you know, get paid every week. You know, it's all the same to me. But, uh, so far, ain't nobody else called me yet. I went through a couple of interviews already, but I ain't heard nothing yet because school ain't really starting up yet out here. So, when they do, then they give me a call, you know. So, let them take their time and do it right. And I can, I can always sit back there and wait for them to call back. So, ain't no need to be going by there or checking up on it or calling them up. I'm just gonna let them do their thing, you know, like I'm gonna do mine. Sit back and relax and wait until somebody decides to call me, you know? But, uh, me, like I said, my job is good. I work in the grocery store, you know? I uh, work in the, uh, the, the deli department. I do a lot of cooking in there. I serve a lot of food, like putting in the trays, putting the uh, price tag on them and stuff like that, you know, for the buyers. You know, and, and do it that way, you know, but it took me a minute to learn how to do the job, but as far as cooking, I already knew how to do the cooking. It was just uh, getting on the register, you know, and putting those tags and putting them on there. We just don't take cash, nothing like that. You have to go to the cashier and pay for it, but that's the only thing good about the job, you know, work seven hours, sometimes I work eight hours, you know, and just getting there and do my thing. You know, because 
Now getting there, it's okay for me, you know, get busy about 5 o'clock and then after what? 6 o'clock, everything slow down. By 7 o'clock, I'm back there busting my, my butt by cleaning dishes, you know, and putting away food, you know, and I mean, a lot of stuff be going on in there I have to do every single day, you know. But a job is a job to me. The way I see it, a job is a job. No matter what you is, what you do inside of a place, a job is a job. As long as you get a paycheck. And that's the way I see it. As long as I get a paycheck, I'm, I'm cool with it. You know, it wasn't something that I really, really wanted. But I ended up doing it because I need the money. You know, so I need the money. need the job to keep myself busy every single day. And it's alright, you know what I'm saying? It's close to home. It's close to my aunt's house, you know. Because right now I'm just getting off the action here. I'm getting ready to turn in. And uh, I got to stop by the job for a minute. I left some over there. I need to go pick it up. And then I'm going to go back uh, to my aunt's house and chill out with her for a little bit, you know. Then after that, later on, I get back to the house and relax. But it's all great out here. It's beautiful. Man, looking at an old school uh, 2012 Chevy Impala. It's okay, but it don't have the nice rims on it, but it's decent. You know? But, um, man, let me get on over because I want nobody to hit me. I got to get all the way over to my right lane here. And when I said getting in... Only regular roads, man, is like a four-lane highway. Four-lane road, not on the highway. It's a four-lane road out here. Decent, you know what I'm saying? A lot of room. So, you don't get a lot of traffic on, a lot of cars on these roads, but when you get on the highway, <laughs> you got a lot of cars, but the highway got six and seven lanes uh, uh, on the highway. So, that's what I like about it. i never seen no two-lane road yet since I've been out here. All I see is no more like on the regular roads, back roads, like a, it's a four car lane. It's decent. I'm loving it. You know? But man. Yep. Everything is all made the same out here. All the buildings pretty much made out of the same material. Very soft, whatever you want to call it. It's not brick. It's weird. Even the warehouse is not concrete. <laughs> they made out of something else. I don't, I don't know this stuff is what it's called, but it's weird. But it's decent. That little car wash over there at the gas station. I'll be going to over there sometime, you know. Let them go ahead and wash the car. By the time we get outside, you know, it'll be completely dry. But they dry it up on the inside and keep on going out the door. That's one thing good about it. That one car wash there. But, uh, man, yep. Man, everybody keep on talking about they can't wait till the weather break out here, you know. Uh, I don't blame them because uh, I ain't about to go outside with myself down with no water. I don't need none of that. <laughs> and they they looking for that rain really quick, but everything out here is pretty much dried up really, really good out here. I mean, it's, it's dried up really good. I don't see how the bushes and, and trees are still looking good and green. Until I found out the secret to it. The secret was they got water lines sticking up off the ground. And it sprinkles everything. And everything else is, is number gravel. Number gravel. Let me turn around. Y'all see that gravel? By the bushes? That's all it is. Number gravel and bushes. But those cactus, cactus trees they got out here. Man. Woo. I try my best to stay away from those. At all times. Because I ain't taking no chances of falling on one of them cactus. You know, a lot of people would like to see something happen like that, but not from Lost with Jerry. I ain't trying to get close to him. I stay away from him. Sometimes I walk to the store, I just, I, I stand, I walk in the street. I ain't gonna sit there and walk the store. Walk. No, I ain't taking no chances with nobody. Give, give me a push, and next minute I'm falling down in cactus. You, imagine Lost with Jerry with a bunch of cactus in his body. I mean, from the back on up. Man, that won't be good. No, no. So I pass on that one. <laughs> so, yeah. 
My auntie owns a cactus tree. I don't even like it. You know, don't never did like it. But she she take care of it very well. But you just gotta watch yourself when you get up to the top stairs. Because that bad boy sticks out. And it was like, hey Jerry, keep away from that cactus. Man, hey, you ain't got to me but one time. And I'm done, you know. But uh palm trees is beautiful out here. I love that too, you know. First time seeing those, but I had to grab one of them see if it was really real. And it is real. But you know, they more like don't grab on the tree. You know, you might hurt it. Man, bump that tree. But it's all good. I'm trying, let me back up. Red Ruby here without scratching up my wheels on this curve. Alright, I guess I'm clear now. But yeah, I need you guys' help. Uh, with Lost with Jerry channel, let me know. What should we do with this channel? And just like I said, whoever come out with the best answer, uh, then I'll be putting your name on my front of my screen, you know, my title, and, uh, and I'll let everybody know uh, that person, the one that gave me the idea to do that, you know what I'm saying, so that's what I'm going to need from y'all, okay, let me know, and I'm there rocking with you, but right now I'm at the job, I'm at Safeway, uh, grocery store, so got to go inside, do what I got to do, get the stuff I need to get, and get out, and keep going from there. But uh, anyway, I'll be getting back with y'all next video. You know, much love goes out to all of y'all. And everybody else that's out here in Phoenix. You know what I'm saying? Uh, don't forget to holler at your boy. You know what I'm saying? I'm here and I'm, I'm around here and there. You know, but just let me know something, all right? Peace. We out.